All right, nice. Kaladin's healing. Apparently those merchants left, but nobody's attacked, so that's good. All right. Oh, you know what? I missed some follows. Uh, Rusty Wires and Lord Hust McDouche. <laughs> what amazing names. Thank y'all for following the stream. Appreciate that. I turned my follow notification off because I'm getting this... These robot follows that I, I just don't want to have to deal with. So, okay. How's Kaladin doing? He needs to heal by a lot. So... I'm guessing to build a wheat straw farm... I'm going to need like 10, 10 wheat straw kind of for a small farm like I did for the other thing. So I'm going to let her finish this research then. I think I may go um, try to hire that Kang guy in wherever it is. Whoa. Okay, they didn't attack us. Thank goodness. You say he's in, um, he's in Squin. That is, I think, where I went before to get uh, Ruka. So if King is also in Squin. Maybe I can go get him going. Okay, good. All the hunger's good. All right, good. All right, wheat straw farming learned. So to make a wheat straw farm, small one takes 10 wheat straw. Okay. Okay, cool. So I'll need to get 10 wheat straw, which I've only found two, and that was from stealing from that guy in the bar. <clears throat> so if I go to Ruka, I mean... Go to Squin. How much does a backpack help? I was thinking of getting a backpack too. Normally Squin, but could be Admag or Last Stand for King. Cost six K. Okay. All right. Um, I am gonna want to do one of these, so let me place one. Like right here. We'll need to get stuff for it, but all right. Well, let's go. Since Callan's recovering, and it's gonna take him a while. I'm going to have her head that way, uh, which is over, oh, which way was it? Well, I think I can click on her. I can click here, and she'll start heading that way. Packbacks are a huge help. Okay. So if I spend all that money I made on hiring a dude in a couple backpacks, do you think it's worth? You want to grab small ninja bags? Uh, if you can, as they have no combat penalties. Yeah, if they're if they're really good, I'm gonna guess I can't afford them. I mean, I'm almost at ten thousand, but if I'm spending six thousand on another recruit, large thief backpacks five k, wooden traders back is eight hundred. Okay. Wonder how long it'll take for this. Uh, Pup to grow. Oh God, we're getting. Who are who are we getting traced by? These hungry people or dust bandits? Okay. Well, she's staying ahead of them. All right, good. Oh God, bandit demands moving towards Kukutopia. Okay. All right, I'm gonna tell her to move inside of Squin. What is this showing? Is that showing my people? What's that blue dot? The blue dot's my people. All right, I got to keep an eye here because if they attack, I'm going to have to have Kaladin run to the other city. Uh, the wooden packs do let you stack stuff. Okay. Oh, God, who's she getting attacked by? Oh, God, the loading. Hey, Lord Hoots McTouche, thank you for the Twitch Prime sub. Appreciate that. Where are these guys? Hungry bandit leaders. Okay. They are faster than her, but... Oh, God. How close is she? Is she anywhere close? 
I don't know if she's gonna be able to get out there. They're gonna try to they're gonna take her food. Oh god, this is so annoying. They're taking out her leg, she's bleeding. Bandit demands have arrived. God damn it, man. Uh, what am I supposed to do when it's like everywhere I go I get attacked and my hometown now has bandits here? Do I need to load? I mean, maybe I need to load to like keep an eye on this. Oh, this is so. Drop food, it can't be stolen. Can I drop it after I've gone unconscious? Or if I just drop it right now, will they not take it? I guess I see how far she makes it here. And I might just have to load. She's getting her ass kicked. It's like no matter where I go or try to do, I just... Like never ending bandits bullshit. Yeah, she's about to go down. Ugh. All right, so if I just, well, the problem is she's never getting up if she's out here. Like, she'll need to be bandaged. Same with backpacks. If you don't have ninja packs, toss them on the floor and they can't be rummaged through. Okay. Uh, like, I wonder if I should just throw my food on the ground, fight, and then wait till she gets back up, maybe. Yeah. <laughs> Please have food. Yeah, no food around here except that food I just dropped on the ground. All right, well, she's unconscious for about a minute. So I'm going to have to lead these guys back. Oh, my God, this is ridiculous, man. Does he have food on him? He does. I'm going to leave one of these Gohans in storage. Okay, I can't see inside my house. I can't see my storage. How do I how do I see my storage when this stupid crap doesn't work? Oh, there was there was a button I pressed. What was it? Control Alt F eleven or something? Uh, which will change a scene for mine. If I do this and then do this, will that work? What if I have him go outside, then do this? And do this and then have him go inside. Is that gonna load? Why well, won't the interior load? Is there is there a way to do this? Alright, well this is gonna change my scene. I think there's like a reload thing here. Did that work? Shift Alt F eleven. Anyone know what the button is for? It happened when I had a guy who wouldn't be able to leave a, a thing. Is there like a way to reload so I can actually see the inside? <sighs> Alright, I guess I just have to put one of these on the ground. Buggy, buggy ass game is buggy as hell. Alright, there, now you can eat that, Sylve. Alright, so she's playing dead. Pick up your food. Um, okay. Now it's just saying loading and not doing anything. Okay. Okay. So you can pick up yourself. Pick up your Gohan. Medic. Hopefully those guys aren't still close by. Okay. Pick that up. Medic. 
Time to pay the price. All right, these guys are going to attack, so I got to lead them back to the other town. Do I have to talk to them? Yeah, I have to talk to them. Okay. Control shift 11. Okay. She'll be fine. Good training. What was the training she just got? Okay. It's tax day, mother effer. Pay your dues. I'm not paying anymore. Break his jaw. <laughs> All right. Making enemies of the dust bandits. I just broke his jaw and then I ran away. Are they going to attack or what? There they go. Okay, so I guess these are the same guys who threatened me before who... But are just keep running away. So I guess I'm making enemies of these dudes. The training she got was getting her ass kicked. Okay. Okay. Who's this? An escaped servant. Is he going to fight me? You're not going to fight me? Okay. You still need to heal some. There we go. We can move inside. It's a miracle. Yes, heal yourself, please. You are going to bodyguard Kaladin. Uh, never mind. You can't bodyguard for some reason. You were able to before. Okay. Have you healed yourself? You healed yourself. Okay. All right. Let's head into town see if we can pick up this, uh, uh, this guy. Man, going between places apparently really low uh, is rough on this game. The only way to get, train your toughness is to get your ass handed to you? Okay. Toughness is at 16. Slowly getting her athletics up at least. Okay, well, she survived at least. That's good. Be why Kaladin's so tough. Uh, well, actually his is lower. Because his melee defense is really high. Hey, what's up, Ramses? How's my weekend? Pretty good. Pretty good trying to stay busy. Okay, so when he's finished healing, I will have him start uh, working on something. Maybe she can... The thing is, I need 10 wheat... And wheat takes up so much space, so I, I would I feel like I would if even if I could buy the wheat in this town, I feel like I would need a giant backpack that can carry ten of them. If I wanted to create a a wheat farm. This game looks hella confusing to you. I mean it's an what, did she just run through the floor? Okay. Um it's uh, the sandbox game, so all right. So let's see. We're looking for what was that guy's name? You said we'll see. I'll I'll recognize if I see him. Zep. Fumin. Uh, Sheck warrior shop guard. What is happening? Uh, she went on the top, but I couldn't see. God, this game is buggy. I really wish they'd make that work better. Uh, shop guard. Okay, so it looks like he's not. Oh, there's one person here. Hot longs. I think that's somebody I can recruit, but I don't think that's the name that you said earlier. This game really is confusing. It takes a bit to get fully acclimated and understand its rules limitations. Yeah. Um, where's the bar? I think the bar was over here. Yeah. Okay, who's that? That is Pacifier. I think that's a guy if you have, like, you mess up your reputation or something. Rain the Giant. Soto. Oron. Kang! All right, there's Kang. All right, I'm going to do a hard save here and see if we can recruit him for, what did you say it was, like 6,000? I think I did talk to this earlier. All right, he looks pretty badass. Let's go see if we can recruit Kang over here. Uh, 
I am looking for protection. You got any skills? Check where? Do you really need to ask? Doesn't tell me how skilled you are. I could crack your skull with these outcasts. Does that answer your question? All right. All right, that should do it. 6,000 cats. Fighting alongside an outcast will be a new experience. All right, you're hired. Now you are my sister. Nobody will touch you. I hope you're buff. Let's check out his skills. Whoa, yeah, he's got way better weapon skills. 20 strength, 25 toughness. What kind of gear is he packing? Just a single sword, advanced med kit, and uh, some crappy pants. So, too bad I don't have the gear from uh, the, uh, the other guys. Those ninjas we had earlier. Okay, so for now I'm going to tell him to bodyguard her. See if any... I want to... This person with the giant name, I'm interested in their, what they are. I'm one of the best. Yeah, 7,500. Okay, yeah. So probably everyone else is going to cost a crap ton of money. Um, so I want to... I now have 3,000 left. I want to go see if I can get backpacks possibly which they were for sale at the shop over here before so I need to wait till they open he's one of your best fighters you love King he's a solid medic too he will serve you well for a long time cool well I definitely need it because my uh, I've been losing every fight so far all right so I guess we just wait till this shop opens There's another trading shop. There's a couple different trading shops we can get stuff from, looks like. Keep him on sabers, though. He starts at 22 on them. Okay. Oh, uh, I guess sabers are different than katanas, huh? Okay. Well, my goal for this was I want Kaladin to become, like, a master weaponsmith. So I'm hoping that's kind of my goal. Get a just a basic settlement with the basic stuff to keep us alive. Well, I want him to become, like, a master weaponsmith. All right, so I gotta just wait till the store opens here. Um, I probably need to get multiple beds back in my place, so I wonder if I should get another sleeping bag. The problem is, well, I wonder how much wheat. The wheat was like really big. I don't know how much back, how much space backpacks give you. You're away for an hour. How did I recruit a new member? All that money I made from looting those ninjas. I just spent six thousand on this guy. Slave traders, huh? Okay. Apparently I can't tra talk to the slave traders, so I don't know how you... How you actually... I wonder if you're carrying somebody, if they'll then talk to you or something. Okay. Kaladin's full healed. Got him to continue training there. Um, Iron Club to train. But he needs this thing. So, have him do that. We'll go back to her. Yeah, I hired him for 6k, 6K by chat's recommendation. So, hopefully he'll be good. I trust you, chat. I trust you. Definitely more about no more about this game than I do, I'm sure. I want to open the door. Open up. I want to buy stuff. There we go. Am I liking Kenshi? I am. It's it's kind of a slow game, but uh, I definitely am enjoying it. Yeah, I finished the research on Shalon for the wheat farm. All right. So he's got medium backpacks. These things are 1,500. I was looking at these small ones before. Uh, is it even worth getting small backpacks? I guess is the question. Maybe if I got the wooden backpack, would that let me carry more wheat? So this allows for better stacking of large items within a smaller space, particularly trade goods. If I got one of these, would this allow me to bring wheat back if I found it for sale? The slavers enslave anyone unconscious. Whoa. 
Okay. Well, what if I get... So that's going to be 800. One of those. And... Gosh, do I splurge and give him a 1500 one? That's going to be most of my money. Bowl backpack. That's only for bowls. This, this hinders you in combat. Only slow you down slightly in a fight. Uh, that's for 1000 That's for $1,500. i am going to get a small one for him. There. Because I want to have the actual money to buy 10 wheat if I can. All right. So let's go see if this other store over here has wheat for sale. So I can get a farm start. Oh my god, this freaking camera. Yeah, they can they cut down a significant amount of your total weight. Well, I mean, maybe I should get a third one for Kaladin then. Let's see if, if I can get the wheat and if I can still afford another backpack, maybe I will. But again, I'm using up all of my money for this, so. Gotta spend money to make money, I guess. All right, he's got 13 wheat straw. Okay, and they are 40 apiece. It's pretty cheap, actually. Okay. Oh, nice. It stacks in her wooden backpack. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Perfect. So that'll let me start the wheat farm. Do I need to... I don't need extra, right? Once I have enough, start the farm. Then we just add water and time, right? We could do a cactus farm, too, if we wanted to do that. I wonder if it's worth having multiples. Because um, I think I'd need 10 plus whatever it would take to start the farm. For those who are experienced in this game, would it be worth starting a cactus farm as well? Uh, in my opinion, we have the cash join the ninja guild that was back in hub for some easy allies. They'll sell you ninja bags and get as many of those as you can. Okay, so you think, what is that like? It's like 10K for that, right? So I need to save up 10K. Maybe I just do this. Let me go. So you're saying it's not worth spending the extra on getting an extra bag. Cactus farm is a yes. Okay. Okay, all right. Um, problem is I think I would need 12 and he's only got 10. But they're cheap enough. We'll buy them all. Because I'm pretty sure I would need to research the cactus farm. Which will take two, and then I'll need ten to get it. So I might have to come back here to actually get the other cactus I need. Unless the like the bar is selling cactus. I think they restock daily. I guess that would mean I could leave somebody behind here, maybe. Let me see if maybe the bar just happens to sell a couple cactus. Where's the um, where's the guy who sells stuff? Is it you? How many limbs teammates and irreplaceable resources have la ran lost so far this run? No cactus for you. No, Kang, you don't have any food, do you? All right. I'll buy a couple of meat for him. Can she being nice? Well, I've saved scum a bunch. I will say, I'll say that. So I guess what I could do is I could leave one of them back here to pick up a little bit more cactus. If I leave Kang here and wait for till tomorrow, um, he can maybe pick up the last of the cactus while we have her go back to start doing, doing the. Uh, you know what? I don't want to do that because she might get attacked. And I would like Kang to help help her from being attacked. So let's get back. I can like send him send somebody back if we need more cactus. Okay, so you are gonna head to Cookie Topia up here. And then I'm going to check on Kaladin. How are you doing? You're doing nothing because there's no iron in here, aren't you? 
Uh, you made the one plate. Okay, so you need to go mine the iron, which is over here. You just have to wait for it to load. Given that the alternative, alternative is restarting the game all over multiple times, it's really more efficient to save scum. Yes. And I've definitely done that. Um, I've restarted... I restarted once yesterday when I started checking out the game when I got pretty wrecked, as I was, I'm sure is normal. Okay, and I guess I'll have him bodyguard Kaladin. Go. And we'll go back to them so I can keep an eye on them here. This is definitely a game where I've learned that save scumming is very important. Is there any way to, whoa, okay, an auto save, to get cactus for like free, like to farm it from the ground or pick it or something, or can you only buy it? Because I keep seeing like over trees, let's like circle with a thing through it. And I don't know if that means if I had the skill, I could chop down trees and get wood or this mushroom here. If I had the skill, maybe I could do something with it. That pops over a lot of stuff, and it makes me think I should be able to do something. This, um... Yeah, like this this pop-up here. Like, look like ruins, but I guess I can't, like, loot any of it or anything. Okay, how to research. I found a blueprint? I wonder if, I'm not sure what that means. I don't really have a blueprint that I see. Okay. I'm guessing you have to buy seeds and all the other stuff. Otherwise, it'd be too easy to just go gather things. Or maybe you just have to have really high skill or something. Oh, oh. Okay, uh. It's two hungry bandits. So let's see how good Kang is and let's have her help fight. No, it's not just two. Okay, Kang, follow. It's not just two. That is a bunch. Okay, we're running. Oh, but we're slow. Uh, ah, God damn it, man. So I need to I need to drop my pack is what I need to do, right? Or they'll take my wheat. What's up, Scottish Pingu? So basically, I need to drop both their packs and all my food on the ground so they don't take it. Is that right? I mean, unless we win this fight, which I am not very confident in with its 2v... 2, 3, 4, 5, 6... Unless Kang is just a badass. Okay, so... Drop this. Drop this. Drop this. Kang, drop this. Okay. Alright, so let's, let's give this a try. I'm probably going to have Kaladin start making his way over here so that he can, like, revive them once they inevitably go down. So let's see how this goes. Quick save. I'm hoping Kang will, like, one-shot them all, but he's already getting wrecked pretty hardcore. It's like, I don't know if you ever get strong enough where you can take larger numbers of enemies down consistently. Probably eventually you would, but we took out uh, one guy. No, no, Shalon's injured. <laughs> she, she got taken out. Oh, we got a wandering shinobi assassin helping us. King, run over here. Run over behind this guy so that they uh, fight him. Okay, we'll split Kang and the Shinobi Assassin versus the world. Eventually you can, and it's glorious. Okay, I look forward to that time. Okay, Kaladin, you're going to fight this guy. K 
Cal and I want to be good with pole arms, so he's using a staff. Oh, Shallan's getting up. Medic. Oh, Kang's doing a pretty good job, I gotta say. Shallan, I told you to medic. Ah, oh, crap. Okay, well, that apparently can't do that. Well, there's fights to be had. What's Kaladin doing? He's pretty good over there. All right, this Shinobi assassin just saved our ass. Wow, Kaladin did a pretty good job, too. Look at Kang, man. All right, his leg is messed up, but... Shinobi assassin, you want to help me finish these guys? <laughs> Please? Hey, we did it. We freaking did it, man. Uh, the wandering shinobi assassin came to help. Hey, and there's our dog who's really slow can come help right at the end, too. That's that's the first time I fought a bunch of wandering dudes and actually won the fight. Although I will say if it weren't for that shinobi assassin, I don't think it would have happened. But okay. Kaladin, Medic. Kang, Medic. That's a GG cookie time right there. <laughs> we live to tell the tale. F5. You can set Kang to block while a shinobi takes care of business. Oh, I guess I could have done that, huh? All right, recovery coma. That well, looks like I'm going to have to pick her up. Um, all right. Let's, um, first things first. Kang, go pick up your backpack. Callan, you're going to pick up, um, the wooden backpack here. Get the wheat straw. Go on. Have to carry her back. All right, his right leg is not in good shape. How's still doing? So nobody's bleeding out. If you shift-click on the medic button for King, he'll auto-medic after every fight, as it will set as a job. Okay. And, uh, gonna have him... So he's got his thing, his pack on. Okay, good. Okay, good. Hunger, we're looking good on, everybody. Okay, so you... You're gonna be bodyguarding Kaladin now. Well, we're gonna loot loot these dudes, and then we'll pick up pick up our girl here. Oh, and he actually gets some armor from this, so not bad. I wonder if any of these guys had helmets on. I think there was a bandit leader, wasn't there? Hungry bandit leader. Yes, let's loot him. Uh, he had crappy sandals. Okay. Horse chopper. That's the same thing he has. 372. It's a crappy version of that. Sells for 12. Sells for 12. So get as much good loot. I think the weapons are usually the best loot, if I'm not mistaken. Okay, nothing there. Could get that. Kaladin. Okay, yeah. Go. What is he doing? I want you to go loot this girl. He's so slow, man. Looks like you were in Squin. You don't see the free recruit, though. Um, I already got her. Uh, she's she's Shalon here. Unless there's a different one, I got her and renamed her, is what I did. All right, so there is a weapon on this guy. All right, do I see any more weapons on any of these people to, to loot? Sandals. Yep. There. I think otherwise we will... I guess we have... Yeah, not enough room for that. Okay. So I think that's good. So what I'm going to do is have Kaladin pick up Shallan. Because she's in a recovery coma until her chest gets better, which is going to be a long time. So you pick her up. All right, we're gonna start making our way home. God, I hope we don't get attacked. Oh, we got we got more weapon loots over here. F 
thief. Really? <laughs> Were you playing dead? He must have been playing dead. Okay. Um, put down. Attack. Oh, God. Come here. Get up so we can kill you again. Get wrecked. Now take his stuff. No more weapons for you. Disarm these guys. No more weapons for you. Okay. Okay, where'd Shalon go? She flew over here. So, pick her up. No, 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 no. No, pick up. No, not that. Pick up. How do I? There we go. Pick up Shalon. There we go. All right, now for the long walk home. How close did we get uh, to our home? Uh, okay, we're not too far. I can see it from here. So I'm going to click there. Quick save. Might be worth getting a splint kit from Squing. Squin. Uh, we're actually closer to our home than we are for the other. I'm just going to let him... If I get a, if I get him home and let him sleep it off, I think it'll be okay. It's almost it's almost n not negative, so when it becomes zero, he'll be able to move again, right? Hopefully, let me just keep an eye on them. Actually, what I can do is I can tell Clang, uh, Clang Kang that I want him to head. Well. Who's, it? Who's that? Is that the Shinobi assassin over there? That guy's like guarding my home. That guy's awesome. It's freaking Ruroni Kenshin over there. Okay, hopefully he can make it back. We are a beat up team, that's for sure. All right, I need, I need a second bed. I probably should have gotten a second uh, sleeping bag that I could have converted into another bed at my home territory. I gotta keep an eye on Kang, because if he gets jumped on, he's in trouble. But he's got meat to eat. Wonder I don't know if he'll eat it from the backpack, if I'll have to do that for him to eat it or not. Okay. Keep heading over this way. Man, that Shinobi assassin kicked ass. I wanna look at his Did he even take damage? Looks like he took a very small amount of damage. Y'all are right. I need to save up 10,000 and join the Shinobi Assassin group, if that's, or Shinobi Thieves, if those are the people that everybody likes to join, since they have their really nice backpacks or whatever. All right. Well, I am very excited that we didn't die. Very excited we didn't die. So, how does rescue? Order your selected character to pick up all wounded allies. If you own any buildings, they'll take the wounded and put them in beds. Yes, yeah, so I want him to rescue. So, will that mean... Okay, that means he's not... I guess I have to carry... Do it myself here. Okay, so can I put her in the bed? If I do this, will he put her in the bed? Good. Okay. So, in the meantime... I wanted to get a wheat farm started. So, um, Kang is going to head over this way. And you are going to do build. Uh, oh, wait, I already started the wheat farm, didn't I? It's over here. Uh, cancel. Yeah, so now we just tab the wheat to do it. Beautiful. Yay for not dying. That is my goal in real life and in most video games I play. Beautiful. All right, we got ourselves a wheat farm. All right, so I just need to get this thing water, uh, which I don't think it needs water, but I think water makes it go faster, I assume. All right, Kang is back. How's your leg doing, sir? Is there like a, I wish there was like a rest thing that doesn't need a bed, but I don't know. I do have stuff to sell. So I could have him 
take all of the stuff from Kaladin that I want to sell and take it to sell while Kaladin is uh, working on getting this farm together as much as we can. Uh, Shawn, what's her inventory look like? She doesn't have anything she needs to sell. Does he have? He has the good first aid kit. So I'm going to go over here. I'm going to have him trade with Kaladin. And he does have these, like, weapons that can go sell. I'm, I'm pretty proud of Kaladin. He went in and helped with the fight and didn't even get that beat up. Way to go, Kaladin. Great job. Kang tanked it up. He bought the time to save Shalon from certain death. In the meantime, this guy, he'll go, go over here and sell stuff. Is it normal that, like, one of these shinobi dudes will just hang around your your place? Hang around your whatever it's called? Okay, did that work? Growing 1%. Crop yield 60%. Is that normal, or am I just lucky that that guy's randomly hanging out? They wander? Okay, he's he's been wandering and hanging out by my place for a while, so... Oh, I needed him to turn off this. There. Okay, let's go sell. Okay. Is there anything I want to pick up while we're here, too? Um, I mean, just saber. I wonder if I'd want to look at actually upgrading his sabers, if that's, his, like, his best weapon. I think since Kang's going to be one of my main fighters, I want to maybe change out Shalon's sword for his. I don't think I want this iron club. Because this horse chopper is 0.5 damage. It's 0.56. It's only 0.06. Oh, he's got a really nice pole arm. Uh, these things are expensive. It's probably not worth. I should probably just make him a weapon. Hope I make a better one. I'm not far from their bar, so they're going to be in their vicinity. Is their bar the one in... In the town that you start near, start near. Bolts cooked vegetables. Okay. I don't think I need anything from here. Hopefully we're about to have a source of food. With this wheat, I probably have to learn baking though, don't I? I'm guessing I have to learn baking. The ring saber comes with a defense bonus. It's much better than that chopper he has. Okay. I think I might try to build it because I want to... Like, my goal for making money is I want to make weapons. So... Their bar was the one I was just in. Oh, that is their shinobi bar. Oh, so that's where I would go to join them. Okay. Okay, awesome. Um, Shalon, I'm going to have you take a break because I want to research... What do I want to research? Um... You know, I actually might need to pick up books. Baking. Yes. Baking. So I need him to go pick up books, actually. I need two books. I should pick up extra books, though. She's still sleeping? Okay, good. I was wondering why there was this bar in the in the middle of the place where... It, these guys say trade ninjas, though. They don't say the shinobi whatever. So I don't know how I would join them. Okay, you have, really, only one book? I only have lots of books. Ring. Oh, there's the Ring Saber blueprint that costs 6,000. Okay. Naginata. I want to build all these things. This thing's got a defense bonus over this plus four. Actually, it's got the same defense bonus as I have. It has less of an attack negative bonus, I guess. So it's it's a slight upgrade, but I don't think I want to spend that much money on a slight upgrade. Right, I'm going to have him go pick up um, uh, am, I, am I crazy? You have water, right? Okay, I don't want you to put it in there, so close the bag. What are you doing? Does it not need water anymore? 
Am I crazy? I don't know why you're not doing it. Okay, you know what? Kaladin, you go do the research. Uh, we're going to research... Wait, I can't... Is there anything I can research? Um, actually, let's do regular storage boxes to start. And you can start doing that. There we go. Okay, we need books for the research to do... No, no. I need to keep an eye out because he's slow right now with his leg. Quick save. See if I can get any more books over here. Tower and hub is where to go. The ninjas have a tower and hub. There's a manual talk to there. Tower, huh? Ah, is it this place? I never went in there. Thief boss, shinobi thieves. Gotcha. Okay. I never even noticed that tower. I always just hung out in the bar <laughs> in Shinobi. Or in uh, Hub, I guess is what this place is called. Okay. But I need to wait till I make 10,000 anyway, I believe. So, all right, there's some books. I want to buy... Oh, God, these things are pretty expensive. I can only buy one. So that's enough books for us to at least get bread going. So this is probably something I should have done earlier, but again, I am a noob, so. Got some, we got a dust boss over there. Is he fast enough to run away from them? No, his leg is still not looking good, so let's not pick a fight and bring him back to the, to the bar for safety. Uh... Fair, you did too. For what did you? What did you do as well? You uh, didn't even know that was there for a long time or something too. Oh, Shalon is mostly healed. Apparently, she's tired of sleeping. Um, she does need some food. Okay, so how's this doing? So this is growing. So that is growing. I'm gonna have her. Um, I want to get more iron plates, so I'm going to have Shalon work on, if I have her to do this, she should go pick up the iron and then work on it, right? Okay, she's not, she's confused. Okay, you need to go over here, Shalon. Kang is sleeping, perfect. Okay, I want you to do that, but I don't actually want you to get stuff. I want you to do this. I want you to pick that up and then go work on that. Get metal refining. Did we finish um, research? We did. Um, Kang has the books. Uh, let's do this. If I do it this way, can I just take it out of his inventory? I can. Okay, cool. So we're going to have Kaladin, Research. Um, uh, it's farming? It's baking. Okay, baking. All right, let's learn how to bake. Don't sell to the Shinobi. Just buy as a 50% discount works both ways. Okay, so don't sell to them. I don't know... Who I should be selling? Do you mean not sell to the guy in the bar or what? I don't. I don't know what that tip. Who? Who? who exactly? I do not know to who to watch or referring. Holy Nation assault incoming. Run before they arrive. Where did it say that? I. I did. Um. Ignored them the last time they came because my my guy was literally unconscious when they showed up. So let me do a hard save here. Did I did I not did that did it say that and I didn't see it? Map on the faction tab. Holy Nation Assault. Target, list, target Nameless Cookie Topia. Okay. 
Can I see where they're coming from, I guess, is the question. I think he means after you join them, you'll get a discount to buy, but they'll get that too when you sell. Okay, so once I join them, don't sell to them. Gotcha. Well, can I finish my baking thing before they show up? Okay, I've researched baking. So you're saying I should run before they arrive, huh? They're a red dot on the map. Um, I see a white dot. Mm. Um, okay, well, I guess I still don't see that, so I'm going to be greedy and stay here a little bit longer, I guess. Um, for the bakery, what do I need? Food, bread oven. I need four building materials, and I think I have a couple. Um, I guess I can do this inside, right? Could also be a white dot because they are not hostile. Okay. Um, is it better to put this inside or outside? I'm probably going to want beds and stuff inside, so maybe I do this outside. I don't know. It said something about your stuff can take damage outside, but industry stuff I'm going to have outside, I guess. Confirm. So you're saying it could be this white dot, which means they'd be coming from over this way, I think. I wonder if I can see them yet. Okay. Yeah, I have a couple building materials. Have at least let's go here. I have the book. Do you think I could convince them since I have the book that uh, they don't need to attack me? I'm wondering if I could convince them they don't need to attack me. Because I have the book and I can say, you know, I was just I was not here the last time you dropped by. I was recovering back in town. Is that a possible thing that I could do? Can I use my charm skill against them? Maybe. I don't know if that's something I can do. Let me speed this up and I see if I can see the white dot moving. Okay, they're coming from over here. With Khaled and I should be able to talk. Okay. If someone's visiting you, you can leave and wait out of sight and wait for a couple of hours. Normally they leave without problems. Yeah, I think my issue was the last time last time they came here, only Shal Shalon was here, and I and uh, I, when I tried to talk to them, they got really pissed off. So I I loaded it so that it didn't save that. But uh, I'm gonna have him have the book on him and see if Kaladin can convince them that he's an upstanding citizen. Okay, they're almost here, so I'm gonna save. And try it. And keep her out of sight? Okay. Alright, I'm going to have her just go hang out in here then. Pretend like there's totally not any sacrilegious people that you're racist and sexist about here. Totally none. Okay, alright. Let's see if Kaladin could go talk to these guys. I see, I see that you guys are very serious. I, I, I will love to participate in prayer. I've got my book right here. Remove the wicked parasites that invaded our sacred dominion. Uh-oh, it's looking like this is not going to work. Paladin's at the ready. I would love to talk to you. Nope, destroy them. <laughs> okay, well, they didn't even give me a chance, so... Um, well, you know what? For fun, let's run out. I'm going to get Kang, Shalon, and Sylv out here. I'm going to see if the Shinobi can help me fight these guys. 
Kaladin, run. The Shinobi's fighting. Okay, we're just gonna see if I can survive this. I'm gonna guess not very likely. But we'll do this for fun and then I'll quick load. Let's see what happens here. All right, let's see how this fight goes. <laughs> One Shinobi versus the world. I'm actually more interested in how well this guy does. Oh man, we're getting wrecked, that's for sure. <laughs> Only the hungry groups rob your food and then leave. All other want to do their work. Cannibals eat you, bandits want money, and if nobody's there, then they leave. Okay. Yeah, Sylv got knocked out. Shalon got knocked out. Kaladin is crawling around on the ground. Look at the shinobi go, though. No, she's got a messed up leg. She is kicking their ass. Kang's still going. Way to go, Kang. Getting pretty beat up. Have we knocked? Uh, wow, look at the look at the. Because if if we could win this, I could get so much loot. But I don't think there's any way we win against like twenty dudes. All right, the assault has ended. But the shinobi's still kicking their ass. <laughs> wow, Kaladin got so messed up. You can set all your guys to block so they don't make, take damage, but their defense is drastic, drastically better. Yeah. Wow, look at her go, man. She's critical, but she is okay. Oh, they are they are looting are they looting us? I'm not sure what they're looting there. Oh, Silv is dying. Okay, nobody else is dying. So if their assault has ended, I wonder if I can somehow recover from this. She's playing dead. Uh, how long are they going to continue looting here? If she gets up, what are they going to do? I'm going to tell her to go here and try to save this guy and see if they attack her. I probably, I'm probably going to quick load. The Wandering Assassin, she's playing dead. Okay, see if you can save Sylph. My poor little... Man, they just killed a little pup. I'm trying to kill my little pup. It's so rude. We might be able to recover from this, maybe. Because there is there is loot on the ground that I want. Recovery coma. Conscious. Like, could I even loot... No, the girl, the shinobi's playing dead, so that would be rude if I took her stuff. Oh my god, look at how badly messed up Kaladin is. Okay, well I think we've saved Sylv. Let me actually work on Kaladin now. Oh, her chest is... Not in great shape either. All right, he's about to be up and he can help medic. Okay, good. They're running off. So if I loot them. Kane, can you get up? He's critical. He can't get up until I get him at a critical, I guess. Uh, let me do this. So if I can get him up, does she? How, how's her med kits going? Uh, I probably need more. Let me give. I wonder if I can give. Uh, uh, 
I'll have to swap over once she runs out of med kits. Actually winning fights one day. One day. Let me trade. Let me get his med kits here. So if I can at least get him up, he can help bandage people. That guy's about to get up. I'm looting my, missing my loot opportunities while I try to do this. Although if they're in a coma, oh, she's looting. Okay, he's in a recovery coma. All right. I want to loot before I lose my opportunity. Okay, that sells for eight, not worth much. Sells for 169. Ooh, combat cleaver. I wonder if that would be an upgrade for uh, Kang. I get all their weapons, maybe. Um. Oh, wait. So she's using a plank, which is a heavy weapon. These are hacker class. So I don't know if that would be better than her plank here for weapons. It sells for a good amount. You can transfer items by drag drop from inventory to the picture at the bottom too. I don't need to trade. Oh, really? So if I do this, then I can do this. Okay, great. Thank you. So value for 15. So it's probably not worth getting any of these things. Okay. So he is recovery coma. I need to start working on Khaled in here. He's unconscious. His leg is messed up too. Check her weapon stats on her sheet to see what she's good with. So she's pretty good with hackers too. So if I could, I could give her one of those if that's going to be useful. I, I don't know if this is recoverable with how messed up all of our stuff is, but I'm going to see. I just want to see if we can recover from this. The question is going to be if I have enough bandages, honestly, I think. You love Kenshi, one Klaus Dieter? Well, I'm learning it. I might I might not even have enough first aid kit stuff. I'm going to have to take Kang's away that he has. Okay, why aren't you fixing his right leg? Come on, fix, fix Kaladin's right leg. There we go. Beautiful. Okay. All right, she is out of med kits. Did I... Do I have any more? I can't. Kang has a med kit. Okay. Let me give this to her for now. Just trying to conserve this. But we gotta gotta fix everybody up, and then I can go buy more med kits. Hopefully, with the money I have from the other stuff. Oh, Kaladin, crippled. You're fine. Just go have a nap. All right, they're both in the process of healing. Silve. Okay. Okay, I think we I think we will recover everything if we can't wow that that advanced med kit is crazy fat or standard first aid kit. It's doing work. As your first aid aid improves, your kits and bandages go for longer. Nice. Okay. Look at the Shinobi girl, she's still freaking going around uh doing her thing. Okay, so Callan's crawling back to go sleep. <laughs> right, she needs to take care of herself too, but I want to make sure they're not bleeding anymore. Okay. Shalon, medic yourself. Okay, and actually, I'm going to give his backpack to her. And she is going to sell stuff.
I think we're going to make a recovery. So, you know, what? we're going to survive this raid. Live to fight another day. Live fa nada. Live fa nada. Okay, so you go here. Uh, what doesn't kill us makes us stronger because we got a lot of toughness from that, right? Sells for 15. Just take their pants. Pants always beats no pants. Is this armor any good? I wonder. I don't think it's as good as what we have. Um, actually, Kang, it might be better for him. Yes. Uh, out of trading range. Okay, let me do it for Shalon. Do this. And then give that to him. That'll be good to hit. There, give that to her. Oh, she might not have room for that. Oh, there it is. Okay. Okay. Take all their pants. Okay. Search for Medi by the enemies. Search for Medi by the enemies? What does that mean? Hey, what's up, Kenny? How are you doing? Um, so here's the question. Should I use, you know what, this combat cleaver is pretty darn good. Is that better than her weapon? Her weapon sells for more. 0.52, 0 0.60 damage. This is less damage, but has better armor penetration and is better versus robots. How's the streams? Going pretty well, Kenny. It's good to see you, man. I know what you mean by medkits, but I don't know what you mean by search for them by the enemies. I don't, there's no enemy kit. They don't have any. I'm looking, I'm, I'm looting them and they don't have any. So if she's pretty even. This weapon's probably, this one's lighter and can get through armor. I don't feel like it's good enough for me to want to swap them out. Or that enough better that I want them to swap out. So Kaladin's healing. How's my, how is my uh, my wheat growing after all this has gone on? Okay, all right, we have survived. Sylv, when you get up, you're gonna go. Hopefully, live with Kaladin, whose leg is going back and forth. Normally, enemies have at least one set of bandages. Well, you saw all the loot there; they didn't have any. Um, I've never seen an enemy have any bandages on them. I don't know if that's because I haven't fought higher level enemies, but not a single set of enemies has had bandages on them that I've seen. So. They all pretty much only have armor and weapons. They don't usually have any other loot that I've found. Uh, a few have had like meat on them if they like had hunt, hunted, hunted some enemies or anything. Okay, I'm going to hard save that because we have recovered. And that was uh, hopefully a great lesson in building toughness for our people. I only have 342 cats. So hopefully with selling these weapons, I can get enough to at least get some med kits recovered. The one good thing I'll say about this is hopefully we're going to soon be able to make bread and wheat uh, make bread from our wheat so that hopefully we won't have to buy food anymore. That will be the, that will be a nice goal to have. Let's move this along faster. And hopefully the holy people won't attack us anymore. Or if they do, they'll give us another chance that hopefully Kaladin can say, Yeah, I'm totally a devout follower. Don't kill me. Okay. Okay, that gets us almost up to 1,000. This will put us over 1,000. May also suggest that you keep a smaller weapon on your people that use the larger weapon. That way they will swap out the smaller weapon on the off chance you fight indoors. Most large weapons have an indoor penalty. Yeah, I did. I have her. She has this ninja blade. When those sim, when those ninja guys, whatever they were called, were fighting us earlier, I had a bunch of extra swords, but I sold them all for money. Um, I could have got more loot, but I was having problems surviving. So, But yeah, I'll try to, I'll try to do that gears huh next chance i get i'll try to get
get some small ones. I'm not, I, I mean, even these crappy iron clubs, are those better to have indoors than like my other people's bigger weapons? All right, I'm going to sell, I'm going to buy all your bandages. Yeah, we're going to head back and do that. Loot will always come, that's right. Your huge cannibal raids bring bandages? I don't think I've fought any cannibals yet. I have not fought any cannibals. So these guys are all in recovery comas. They should run away once they recover, I think. How is Kaladin doing? His right leg needs to get back into the green. Poor Kang. Chest. All right, so I need to get, um, I need to make a bakery. So I need, I should have a couple more building materials. Wait, did I, oh, King has stuff to sell. Um, actually, let's check if this combat cleaver is better than this horse chopper. Uh, although I think he likes sabers over hackers, right? Yeah, they're pretty similar, but Sabres is his best, so that's fine. Lucky Cannibals Green, you down, take you back to the village and eat you. Yes, I'm gl glad I haven't had to deal with that. All right, so the stone will be turned into a building. Output, I think I need two more of those guys. Large weapons will cause act active negatives to their combat stats, but again, only indoors, right? Yeah, I've seen that, and I kind of understood it, but I didn't know if it was a big enough difference so that, you know, if I had a choice between using a horse chopper or a little tiny iron club, that the difference would be that big. But maybe it will be, and I'd, I'd need to keep some of those. As far as you know, this game is similar to Dwarf Fortress because you could do as much ridiculous stuff here. Um, I've never played Dwarf Fortress, so I, I don't know about that. But you can basically do whatever you want in this game, I think. I mean, that's in the game mechanics anyway. Okay, so how is Kaladin coming along? Man, it's going to take a while to recover from that. Oh, God. We got some hungry bandits. Uh, I don't think she can fight them, so she probably has to run from these guys. God, just let us recover. Oh, Kaladin's up and fighting. Okay. And he's fighting indoors. Kaladin, you need to get out here. All right, I'm going to try to... God. Well, this guy wants to talk. Hand over your food, nobody dies. Um, you look half dead. I've never talked to a hungry bandit leader before. When is that coming to Steam, by the way? You've been wanting to try it? What, Dwarf Fortress? Counter-argument. Kenshi has a single map set in stone with handcrafted characters, locations, history. Okay. Kenshi is a game where you drop every, should drop any mora, moral. If you try a good run, you'll probably lose. You're a no. Let's talk about this. Give me your food. Put your sword away. I can help you. I can give her money. Um, I don't want to give her money. I want to, like, convince this guy to join us. I'm not worth fighting. I doubt that. Okay. Well. Oh, God. Uh, Dwarf Fortress dynamically generates everything new for each game. All right. So we're, now we're starting to compare games. Okay. I guess I'm going to try to take this fight. Which I'm not super excited about. Since we're still recovering. Okay, Kaladin's like barely able to stand and he's going to take this fight. Right, I did save it earlier so I can quick load if need if need be. I wonder if Kang will get up anytime soon. No, his chest has to be not in the negative, I think. Uh, oh, poor Kaladin. Oh my god. Am I, did I tell him to, f can I do block? Let me try, let me try block and see if he can just hold his own here. 
Why is he not using his weapon? Is his arm too messed up to use his weapon? I think I can't fight because... Okay, let me do this. Maybe if I do that, he'll actually be able to use a weapon. Okay. Maybe you can buy enough time for somebody else to get up. Man, look at him go, though. Look at those blocks. <laughs> Who knew? Kaladin is a master. Oh, he got hit. Uh, Rand, can you check this review off stream? Okay, what is this? Can she review? All right, sure. Maybe I'll try to watch that. Well, he's doing a pretty good job. Problem is, nobody's going to be able to get up in time to save him, I don't think. Um, so he has food, so I need to drop food on the ground. Drop this on the ground. Shalon, does she have food on her? She does. Can I drop it while she's unconscious? I can. I'm going to drop his food on the ground. We're just... Y'all help me remember there's a bunch of food on the ground. <laughs> He's like fighting with one arm, blocking them all. <laughs> oh, he did a pretty good job. He split their injuries. They can fight with the limbs as if they were still good to a point. Okay. Uh, Sylv, yeah, you're not going to get any food from him. Okay. We're just building our toughness up, I guess. Oh, my God. It's like just never ending. All right, play dead. Wait for these guys to leave. She play dead? Yeah, play dead. Sylve has been butchered. Oh, F these guys. All right, we're quick loading. F those dudes. They butchered my dog. You piece of shit. All right, I wonder if I had gone defensive with one, but then the other one attacked, if maybe we could survive that. All right, can I remember... This is before the... Okay, this is before the fight. Uh, okay, I had another... I had. The, I think I do want to load after this fight. So this will be after... After that fight. I know, I know save scum, but... Because um, I feel like it was worthwhile keeping whatever toughness and skills we got from the fight before. And whatever stuff we were able to buy. Okay. You forgot that that's a thing that happened? That they butcher your dog? Where is she? Was she going to sell stuff? She was going to sell stuff, so... Alright. Okay. Man, this game is freaking brutal. They butchered my dog. I guess they were trying to get meat from him or something. Um, I wonder if I could pick him up and take him inside. I could probably do that with Kang, too. It's probably better than leaving them outside, even though... Uh, there's no beds in there. You made this game, by the way? Nice, Kenny. You've made a very brutal game, sir. What else are dogs for? Um, to be your best friend. Even though I'm not a huge dog person. Still. Okay, we do that. Buy the four med kits. And... Okay. That's good. All right, I wonder if those guys are nearby. If so, I want to actually... I want to get back here and get my people inside. I, they feel like they don't go inside the buildings as much. Maybe I'm, maybe they do and I'm just crazy. You think you can eat them too? I haven't figured out how to do that. Um, when it's wild animals, I, I, I know you can loot their meat. But I haven't seen a way to butcher them. Of course, I don't know if you need a tool or if I just don't know how to do it. Okay. Let me let me first things first. Let me pick up Kane. Kang. I'm gonna bring him inside, if nothing else, so he's out of the out of the elements. You prefer a cat. They are pragmatic with a cat. You have the understanding. Whoever dies first is eaten by the other in an emergency situation. Lovely. Very nice. All right. Hopefully he'll heal faster inside or something. I don't know if that's true, but <sighs> of course they will also 
get all floppy when you do that. Splint. Can I splint without a splint? I don't have a splint kit. Okay. Uh, maybe that's something I should buy then. Was there a splint kit back there? I don't know how expensive those are. Okay. And put down. Okay. Would it be worth getting a splint kit, do you think? Okay, so if I, I'm going to give one thing to you, one thing to... Let me see here. What's your field medic? He's at 18. He's at 8. She's at 12. She's actually doing pretty good. But let's give him his good med kit back. Go. Um, okay, so where are those guys? Are they, they coming in hot again? I don't know where they came from, so I'm going to go ahead and quick save now, now that we've kind of recovered, got to our recovery point. Um, oh, she's actually were able to work from inside. I forgot that this was a thing that happened. Okay. Man, where's my Shinobi protector that was patrolling my town that was saving me? I need that guy back, or girl. That girl to save me. Yes, the splint kit is worth it. All right. Um, well, let's go ahead and see if there's one. If there's one for sale, I didn't. I didn't see some trader guys up here. I didn't check. I know there's like apparently you could play as a robot or a skeleton in this game or something. So I've seen skeleton repair kits and seen damage versus robots. So apparently there's other ways. Other Races you can play, too. There's a good Russian joke about dog meat, but you don't know how to correctly translate with your intermediate English. I feel like you've told me dog meat jokes before. Whoa. Nothing of value here, traveler. There's a bunch of nomads. Interesting. Okay. Looking for a splint kit. Um... Electrical components, skeleton repair kit, skeleton repair kit, gears, fabrics. I don't think I see one here. So I'm thinking probably, probably not here. I might have to go to the other town. Um, so I'm going to hold off on that because I, I don't want these all my unconscious people to be like alone back here. And their recovery coma. Because they need, I think, this to be positive before. Actually, you know what? You can get up. So you're going to... You can't carry anyone with this arm. Okay. Uh, okay, maybe I have Kaladin go... Oh, God. No, no, you keep resting. We'll just be patient. Hope we don't get attacked by more bandits. Which is not a very, which is probably a vain hope in this game. Skeletons are robots and are great. Skeletons are robots? What? That's weird. Right, I'm going to go inside. I'm going to close the door and I'm going to mine from inside because that's a weird thing that you can do. There. Here we go. We can mine from inside. So I need two more uh, building materials because I think... Kaladin has one more, yeah. I guess I give it to her, since she's the one who's going to use it. You know what? I'm going to give you the iron club. I'm going to give him an iron club. There we go. Now we all have close-range indoor weapons, if needed. Um, skills with Katana's 10. Skills with Katana's 17. All right, he's pretty even in all those. The, bla the backpacks shop in Squin has splint kits. Well, you know, getting to Splint right now, Squin, whatever, sounds like a pipe dream because we are all have broken arms, legs, and stuff. I don't even feel like I want to try to get there right now. I want to recover before I'm trying to travel at, at all. So I am not going to do that. All right, quick save. Turn this on faster. Even these people... 
can recover anytime soon. Whew, this is a uh, this is definitely a punishing game. But hey, we almost have a town that is self-sustaining. Almost. We got this wheat that's growing. Hopefully we'll get a bakery up in time to... I don't know how much wheat it takes to create bread. Okay, who's this? Who are you walking near my town? You, have a, you are a guy with a bounty on his head. Interesting. Streak has a bounty on his head. Well, let's hope he doesn't attack us because I don't think I could take that guy. He looks... Well, yeah, he's got some armor. He looks pretty scary. I have a feeling we don't want to take that guy on. Here's the joke translated with your intermediary skills. All right. I look forward to it, Kenny. Oh, he's walking up. Oh, God, don't fight us. Okay, he's just walking on by. Holy Nation Outlaw Escaped Servants. Okay. A guy asking a butcher, what did this meat doing when it was live? Was it barking or meowing? It was asking stupid questions. Okay, nice. That's pretty good. It's pretty good, Kenny. Okay. Okay, they opened the door, but we're just, you know, just working. Nobody wants to fight around here. No reason to get all fighty. Tech came out to fix your internet. You've been on BDO for the past 30 minutes with no disconnects, crossing fingers still. Wow, nice, Shogi. Let's hope that keeps up. Oh, Silv is alive. He is alive, but he's hungry. So, um, let's see who has who has all the food on them. Kang had a bunch of food, didn't he? I had a bunch of meat somewhere. Where did all my meat go? Did we eat it already? I feel like we may have eaten it already. All right. Well, I don't want him to die of hunger, so we're going to put this on the ground. Silv's going to eat it. It sounds way funnier in Russian. Hey, it's still pretty good. Uh, reminds me of the, what, the Ronald Reagan joke, right? About... Some Ronald Reagan joke about freedom in Russia or something that you always tell. Okay, so there's two there. So let's go do this. Adding materials. So, uh, no, I want you to go do this. Okay, there we go. All right, sir. Now that we're out here, hopefully you're not going to attack me. No, you're not attacking. Okay, that's good. Kaladin doing. Hey, he's positive, so go pick him up and put him in the bed, because he Kang needs to recover now. Alright, we are recovering slowly. We are slowly recovering. I'm going to I don't see how many big scary things coming. I'm going to do a quick save. What is meat? What is bark? Yeah, something like that. Did Rand find the friendly skin bandits? Friendly skin bandits. N no. I don't know who those are. Okay, so we need one more after this. How's Kang doing? All right, he's, he's slowly... Slowly improving. Um, escaped servants. Okay. All right. They're hurting, so they've, they've been in a fight recently. Are they going to fight us? Are you attacking my guy who is lying on the ground? No, you're just walking in here. Okay. All right, looks like we're okay. Where did they come from? I wonder if there's any loot on the ground I could... You know, opportunistically borrow and then sell to the highest bidder. Okay, so that's done. You go back to that while you take this. 
go do this. Okay, and do one more. I would love to find the friendly bandits. The bandits who go around giving people food. Uh, okay, so I need to give this thing water, I think. Let me actually take a break from this and go get water for the uh, wheat. I want this wheat to be at max yield or whatever it, it would be. All right, another quick save here. I guess I guess those white dots are things that could possibly attack us, maybe. Probably don't need my book on me anymore. That's okay. Okay, go do that. Okay, he delivered that. Beautiful. If that is your definition of good, if you are a cannibal, all the bandits are friendly. <laughs> Since they are food, right? Nice, nice. Stone richness. I wonder if this changes. So my richness is actually lower than 50%, which is not considered good. Can I put this back in there from there? Okay, that's pretty nice. Oh, I had this ninja blade still in here. Okay. Um, let me give that to Kang, then. And he's got stuff that he can sell once he's finally recovered. How is he doing? He's recovering pretty well, actually. Okay. Beautiful. Do that. No, okay, he took the water to this one. That's never going to do anything. I think I need to deconstruct this thing because it says the vegetable farm is too low to be productive. Probably will not be suitable. So can I dismantle this thing? I think I just wasted that water. So I dismantled. Okay, what do we got? Okay, it's these escaped servants that are wounded, so I don't think they'll fight me. Okay. So I kind of wasted that water. Map looks huge. We have only seen one tiny corner of the world. Yeah. Does your richness depend on where, whether you have been grass-fed or fattened up on cord feed? I have no idea. I'm going to let him get all the way to max. How's Shalon doing over here? You're doing good. Let's start doing that. Great. Bakery should be up in time by the time we get wheat here. Hold down the alt key to see if items on the ground. Oh, nice. So I could eat this green fruit, right? Okay, Kang, he's gotten up. Okay, so you go pick up all this green fruit. Kang. Um, so we can eat this in the meantime while we wait. The hell? Ugh. This game is buggy as hell, man. What are you doing? There. Okay. So, this can be eaten, right? Can green fruit be eaten? Um, he's not eating it, so maybe not. I guess we'll just put it in storage for now. Actually, I probably didn't need to do that. I could probably just do it this way. Okay. Come on, pick that up. Pick it up. There. Uh. 
There. Okay, so I have to right, I have to left click if I don't, whatever. Okay, it's kind of awkward. All right. Let's have him go help her with that. Kaladin's got the water, so I want him to put it in there. Okay. And then go help with this. Uh, you can't eat green fruit. Hashtag Kenshi logic. Uh, maybe you can rotate stuff in inventory by pressing R. No, I don't think you can. No. I mean, the rotate button is a different button, and I've tried that before. I do have cactus where I could try to do some, uh, maybe get a cactus farm going, too. You can press the range button below to sort my stuff. Okay, I should have done that then. All right, I want to get this bakery done because, oh, I need to harvest this now. So let's have Kaladin go harvest. Whoo, we got some wheat, baby. Um, number of plants. What's happening? I feel like I lost some there. Or oh, unless he's put it on the ground. Oh, he can fail. Oh. He f so we need somebody, whoever has the best skill at farming, I guess. Well, that's nobody. So, all right. Well, good luck, Kaladin. <laughs> okay, great. So um, let's give this to Kang. He can go do that. All right, well, he's gotten, he got, oh my God, there were like 22 plants. He's gotten three so far. Four. Five. This looks like five out of 22. Wow. All right, well, guess it could have been worse. Okay, so does anybody have a baking skill? Cooking one, one, one. So everybody's at basically one. Cook green fruit, green fruit with water in a stove to make cooked vegetables. Oh, okay, so I need to make a stove. Well, I'm gonna I'm gonna bake here. So Kang, I want you to bake. So oh, it needs water in here too. Okay. So Kaladin. Let's have Kaladin go over here. I'm gonna put uh, water in there. Straw flow. What am I? What am I missing? Wheat straw. How do I make? So am I missing something? You need to go from wheat straw to straw flour. I probably have missed something, haven't I? Baker Henry has the skill. Leveling Kenshi is based to the current level, so if you have too low level, then you train really fast. Okay. So it looks like I need to turn this into a mill. Okay. Yeah, again, I'm a noob, so I haven't done this step before. Um, so if it's just water, maybe. So I got I to gotta, I gotta research something, which means I'm going to have to go buy more books. I thought I could just do the bakery right into it or whatever so okay what do i need next then cooking which lets me make a cooking stove so maybe i should do cooking next uh industry what am i looking for a mill Cotton farming, rice wood farming. Yeah, okay, so I don't see it. So I guess I gotta get maybe the cooking up first. So I need a book. I need more books. Okay. Well, in the meantime, Shalon is doing that. Kaladin is healing. So let's go buy a couple more books, I guess. Uh, Kaladin still has, I think, something I want to sell. Yeah, so give this to Kang. And Shalon, do you have anything I want to sell? Nope, he's going to sell all that stuff. 
All right, go get a couple more books. Wheat to straw flour, then straw flour to make bread. With bread, you can eat or combine with meat to make better food. Right. Take a look. Normally, you should have the tech already. Different tech allows multiple new buildings. Okay, well, okay, so you're saying I need to maybe, maybe I just need to, maybe it's buildable. I just need to look at my build thing. Okay, well, let me get books anyway. I can do more stuff here. Um, any splint kits? Still don't see any splint kits. Okay. Uh, sell these guys. Okay. All right. Well, I'm almost self-sufficient. Let's head back over here and see if there is a... Uh-oh. What do we got? Still those escape servants just wandering around. Okay. It's fine. So build. Crafting. Camping. Tech. Research bench. Bread basket flour storage. So I have storage for it. Iron refinery. Bread oven grain silo. This grinds wheat straw into flour. Okay, there it is. And I need four iron plates. Okay. All right. Here it is. Uh, this is looking weird. Like it's part way in the ground or something. But, all right, it's fine. We'll put it right, right there. Okay. So I need, now I need iron uh, plates for that. Damn. I'm never going to get to my actual weapon smithing if I just want to survive. Okay. Uh, so let's put the books in here. Um, I do want to get the cooking research going, though. So I'm going to have Kaladin do um, tech cooking I have Kaladin do that well Shalon and King we need like eight iron I think eight ore to turn into iron plates well maybe six since I have one plate ready maybe five since I have that there the keys next to your backspace you can set the high level of buildings I don't know what that means set the high level Look at cooking tech again. Cooking stove is there. Yeah, I know. I'm 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 teching it. I'm learning it right now. I mean, I don't have the ability to do it yet. I kind of skipped things. I think going right to the grain silo. So what do I need? So I need seven. So I need seven, which is. 14, so I need 13 raw iron is what I need. So here's goats. If I attack goats, can I win? Pretty sure when I've seen other people fight goats, they get wrecked. I don't think I'm going to do that. Oh, God, Sylve needs food. They all need freaking food. Does anybody have any food on them? He's the only one who's got food. Uh, okay, if we make the stove, we can do green fruit. So hopefully Sylve can survive until we get the cooking thing, which is going to take a while. You know what? I don't want to take the chance. So in the meantime, you go get something so I can feed him something. I don't know. Is this dog worth keeping? I bought this dog thinking that, you know, he grows up, he's going to be one of my best fighters. And uh, he is still a pup, and I don't know how, how long it takes for him to not be a pup anymore. Okay, he's sleeping. All right, we'll let him sleep. It's fine. Uh, there. All right. Try attacking. What are you talking about? No, I'm not going to try attacking those those dogs for no reason. 25, 75. Uh, 25 for one, uh, for 20, 218. 25 for 279. I think the Gohan's the best, but I don't want to feed that to the dog. Okay, you know what? I'm going to get, this is going to be like all my money if I buy that. Okay, I'm just going to do that so I can get rice for, that's rice for the dog. I'm so low on money, man. 
Spin it all in town. Okay, here. She ate it. She ate it before I could bring it back. God damn you, Shalon. But I was hungry. You know who else is hungry? <coughs> Goodness. Okay. You know what? I'm just going to ha give him that. You had your chance for good food. Okay, we're going to get them all working. We need to get this done. Silv, you... Yeah, it's fine. This is my first playthrough? Yeah, I'm, I'm learning. Well, I did one yesterday where I... Kind of got wrecked and then restarted. But yeah, it's basically my first playthrough. He'll be a monster as he uh, ages up. If you can buy a backpack for your bone dog, buy it. You didn't found any for so long. Oh. Okay, that's cool. Oh, are they are they full? I guess they can't. The machine is full. No, it's not. Okay, so she's working on that. Um, let's see here. Let's get Kaladin over here. You can left click on your animals and see their age. I see his age is still pup. I don't know how long it takes for that to change. Bone dog packpacks are a mod, not vanilla. Oh, okay, so I probably don't have that. Since you're already building a base, I want to tell you that there's a lot more to the game than base building. There's an insane amount of content and things to do outside of base building. Well, thanks, Frost Needle. It'll be a while till I get to those things, but that's cool. Um, what I actually want to get into is I want to be blacksmithing. But the thing is, I want to be self-sufficient before I start doing that. So I'm trying to do that. Are these guys attacking us? Okay, I think these guys are attacking us. They just ran right by Shalon, so... Okay, Shalon, you do that. You attack, attack... Attack. And let's have, um, I want one person to be defensive. If one person can, like, block, maybe Kaladin be block. Can I do block, block and taunt? Maybe that's one way you could do that. Okay. Shalon, you run, because I don't want you... Oh, gosh. They both got freaking bows. Oh, my God. She's already getting destroyed. Where's Kaladin? Kaladin, get over there. I told you to attack, man. Shalon's getting her ass whooped. She, like, saved everyone earlier. Okay, Shalon, you back out. You back off. God, you're getting destroyed. Oh, my God. There's more of them. What is Kaladin doing, man? Get over here. God damn it. Jesus. Okay, you go You go ahead and block. I don't know what the hell he's doing. I think this block and taunt thing is messing him up or something. Or he's just really slow or something. All right, well, Kang's like 1v4 over there. Maybe if I have Kang go block while they work on theirs, maybe this will work. Oh my god, they're still showing up. <sighs> Kenji provides plenty of salt. What's up, Attila? It's like 20, 30 days for a pup to grow into an adult. Okay. Okay, I guess I go Shalon, go block as well, while K 
Kaladin hopefully can kill this guy and then go help. There's my little pup attacking. Okay, all right, Kaladin got that. Okay, Kaladin, go help Shallan. Because Clang is in much better shape. There. Okay, that's actually great. Go help Shallan here. Because Kang over there is... Ooh, he is hurting a little bit. So Shallan. Okay, Kang is down. Damn it. Kang. I keep calling him Clang. It's Kang. Oh, Jesus. Uh, it was going well. was going well. Actually, it's not terrible. Ugh, now it's not looking good. His arm, his left arm is broken. Hey, King's back up. Okay. Come on, King, get in there. This looks like a discount Mountain Blade. This is a very different game than Mountain Blade. That's kind of disingenuous description of this game, that's for sure. Uh, God, have I saved it recently? Can you run? Can you run? Okay. Continue to block. Kaladin's going to be back up soon. Maybe he can help. Can you medic yourself, sir? See if he can heal up while she's fighting. Oh, he's going to go heal up his friend. Okay, that's not going to work. Yeah. All right, well, they're walking off. Oh, Christ, man. Yeah, this is nothing like Mountain Blade, Attila. You can enable all, block, don't any attack anymore, but evasion defense is greatly increased. Taunt, provoke enemy attacks versus a block attack, a good combo. Didn't seem to work for me, but... Oh, God. Will I even be able to recover this? Just recovery coma... Oh, my God, man. It's like every time I try to start finally getting something together, some other shit comes and attacks us. They're all in recovery comas. All right, what's my most recent? I got to save Scummit. Let me do this. You went AFK and everyone's dead again? That's what this game is, Shogi. I'm Shogi, Kenny. That is what this game is. It's like every five, every five seconds, there's another group of bandits attacking you. So, all right, I'm safe. coming. I'm going to take my last break of the day. Thanks, y'all, for watching. If anybody new to the stream, please hit the follow. I hope you're enjoying me getting wrecked in Kenshi. Uh, okay. All right, where was this? Well, we have the bakery done. We're working on the silo. So, uh, you know what? I'm just going to AFK and play, play ads. I'll be right back. Thanks for hanging out. Y'all are awesome. And this is stressful. So I'll be back in a bit, my friends.